NFL XP Reviews, back with another episode of As the Beer Swirls. I'm Dan. I am Mike. That's Dan. Mike. <laughs> Dan, what are we drinking? Uh, Mike, we got some German inspiration here uh, from Counterweight Brewing out of awesome. Camden, Connecticut. And this is our smoked Ein. Ein? Ein? Ein, Ein. yeah. Ein. It sounds German, right? Yeah. Um, Ein so, yeah. Finkel. Oh, Ein. Finkel is, Finkel Finkel is Einhorn. Einhorn. Einhorn is Finkel. All right. Oh! Um, this is our smoked Hella style lager. And it comes in at 5% Ooh. ABV. And wow, that's a big lock it's code. It's a huge uh, lock pipe, code. pipe and fire brimstone. And brimstone. Oh, fire and brimstone. 111, 2024. Okay. So we're th about three months out, yeah. Yeah. three and a half months. It's probably still good. Fire and brimstone, huh? All right. Uh, it says, what's <laughs> better? Right. What's better than the alluring simplicity that is a golden German smoked hells? Ooh. Hellas, sorry. No, Our delicate. Bamberg inspired. Oh boy. Bamberg inspired lager offers the naked beauty of a German pilsner. And we're getting sultry. And smoked malt and the delight of spicy Hallertau Middlefru noble hops. Okay. This comes courtesy of Stephen A.K. the resource, like we probably already said before. We did. Uh, but he sent us off a nice beer mail package. He likes to throw counterweight beers in there, and I'm okay yeah. with it. No, every counterweight we've had is... Uh, I really enjoy counterweight. Oh, that looks straw-colored and just hellacy. Oh, there's my one random text from my friend Ryan that he sends about eh, every two months. Still alive? Yep. Yep. Uh, okay, that is just a golden straw-colored beer. Very hazy. Bit of a chill haze on it, but a nice, bright, white, foamy head on it. It looks the part. It looks zesty. Definitely. It looks zesty. You know what? While we do this, mm -hmm. I just want to do this real quick. Just need it on a screen to look at? No, no, no. Oh, that smells so good. As uh, Jal's Arcade would say. <laughs> Smile, like We're going to send a picture to Ryan, who interrupted this beer review. There you go. Um, oh, man. Dude, just get a deep whiff on that. Oh, it is so like grassy, straw, lemony, zesty. Kielbasa? <sighs> Horse blankety. <laughs> Kielbasa. Schnitzel, if you will. Wiener schnitzel. Schnitzel. Never had schnitzel. Oh. You, you gotta get down to the German restaurants. Oh, uh, oh, what's that called? Again. Down there in Candegua? Sagan. Uh, Reimlich. Okay. Named after the river over there. Is this still like appointment yeah. only? Like, uh, not appointment. Uh, I mean, uh, if you're going to uh, like peak dinner hours, I'd yeah. make a reservation. But, oh, that place is great. Oh. This smells so, so tasty. Uh, it's light. <laughs> it smells like my grill. Oh. After I'm done cooking. But oh, Nice lemony zest. But you're right. You get that nice kind of, um... <sighs> Yeah, it's bright. Yeah, it's very it, bright. It's a bright smoked thing going on. So, so I was just going to say the smoke is, it's there, but it's in the background. It's not overpowering whatsoever. So yeah. I'm kind of happy about that. Oh, it smells good. I'm going to that in. Cheers. Cheers. Thank Thanks. you, resource. Actually, Keith got a can of this. Did I watched his unboxing. Did he, did he review it yet? No, I don't think so. I was going to try collabing with them, but doing collabs is so hard. I know it is. It's schedule. hard enough for us to collab. Yeah. Oh, man. Um, the smoke is still very subtle. It is subtle, but it's dominant at the same time for me. Wow, this is like... It's very bright... It's airy. Uh, it's like lemon zested Cheerios. Uh, it's crisp. It's refreshing. The smoke is still in the background. Um, there, there's a sweetness to this beer that the smoke is not overtaking. And I like that. There's a hint of smoke. And th this is my jam. Made a little wheat thin crackeriness to it. Wow, 
Little I gotta tell you. Front. Wow. Okay. You know what I'm thinking? What? Without the, like, obviously dairy creaminess. If you took, like, a Triscuits with mm-hmm. some smoked Gouda on there. Mm-hmm. And, like, mm-hmm. a little bruschetta on it. Mm-hmm. That would be fabulous with oh, this. Because that, that citrus would cut through all that salty. And and the, the smoke would just elevate that Gouda to a new degree. So, back to Rheinblick. One of their appetizers is a nice, like, cheese and meat tray. Mm-hmm. Yeah. This would be fantastic with that. Mm-hmm. Some nice hard salamis. Oh, yeah. Uh, I really like this. This is going down well. If you haven't had a smoked beer before, I would probably, I would probably say try this out. Yeah, this is an entry level smoked beer. Yeah, it's it, it is. It's one of the furthest notes that I'm getting, but it's still there. Yeah, yeah, it's really good. It's a very, it's a very so with with all its bright and uh, bready mm. uh, sweetness that it brings, the smokiness almost. Mm comes off if you say of, what i'm thinking it's going to be impressive but go ahead <laughs> no it's just I, I, go ahead go ahead i think there's a really nice like fresh spearmint leaf back there and i think yeah. that might be what the smoke is coming off as like it's it's a very nice leafy green back there It's weird. It's refreshing yet savory. It it is. What a weird beer, but it is so good. I really like this a lot. Well, we did a, a another smoked Ellis. Ooh, we had one before. We did. It's from Keith. It was uh, started with a Z. Oh yeah, that's it was right. in the bottle. Uh, ooh, we're gonna have to look that up. Yeah, we'll look it up. But zip zip up. Um zip zip. Zo Zoloft. Uh, Zella? No, just look it up. I like all the dead air. What a great label too. Just dead air. Take a look do what at that you gotta again. do, bro. Zillico. 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 Still I didn't sounds, even look it up. It just it popped away. Still yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Zillico smoke. Smoked house lager. There it is. And we checked it in. How young we were back then. Oh, yeah. Look, look at that, guys. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. A couple of, couple of young... <laughs> the windows were lads. open. Nuclear winter in full effect. Uh, it's just... It's know, another time. It was just, you know, just... Are you doing it? You're going for it? I'll, uh, dear God. Our Christ. camera's like, what are you doing? Ah! It's awful out there. I'm glad people can't see it. It's nuclear winter. Just a dreary. You can't see anything. Dreary. Look at that. Look at how awful. Drizzly day. It's awful. But you know what's not awful? This beer. Uh, Steven, thank you for sending this to us. I'm really glad we got to try it. Did we read it? No, but I'm going to. I'll give it a. I'll give it a four three. It's delicious. Um, I'll give it. I'll give it four. Yeah. I don't know if people would want more smoke out of it, seeing as it's a smoked Hellas. Uh, yeah. I can see where people would find a fault right there, but I think it's well balanced. I think it's delicious. I could probably play with that. Get the focus on. Don't worry about it. Yeah. Uh, anything else? Did you rate it? Yeah, the four. No, oh, whatever. All right. Uh, comments down in the description. Link trees. We're all good. Steven, really appreciate you, buddy. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Cheers.